This is a sample of the new moissanite. Uh, it's called Forever One, and it's DEF in color. It's much wider. and also has fewer inclusions, so it's very difficult to identify by sight. When identifying the stone with the tester, it's first important that you wipe down and remove any body oil that may be present on the stone's table. Now first I'm going to use the Presidium Multitester. As you'll notice, it reacted as diamond. Now I'll use the Series Dual Tester. Again, it reacted as diamond. This is the new Gemologist Lapis Tester. Like the others, it reacted as diamond. Here's the new Gemoro Testerosa. With our technology, Moissanite. we can identify it every time. Moissanite. Now I'd like to show you some additional testers and show you how they re react when testing the low conductivity moissanite from Charles and Cobard. Now this is the Oris Nelson Diamondite. As you can see, it reacts as diamond. This is the Presidium Multitester 3. Now this is the latest and greatest Adamus tester from Presidium. This overpriced tester costs $400, and as you can see, it will be fooled by this moissanite. Diamond. Now this is a new model Gemoro tester. This is called the Ultra Tester 3 Plus. This model will be introduced later on in the year, but this tester also has our new patented technology. And as you'll see, that's the indication for moissanite, and it identifies it correctly every time. 